What's up everybody, it's your boy Ian here. For breakfast, um, uh, I had McDonald's breakfast. We went to McDonald's breakfast. There's a good McDonald's and a bad McDonald's. The good McDonald's is closest to us though. Um, we went there and um, we waited like six minutes in the drive through for our food and turns out our food was just sitting there on the counter in the drive through window. Uh, we didn't know it was ours so she just handed it to us. Um, and that was a little bothersome. Um, but that was the only thing that was bothersome to be. My parents were like, oh, oh, the hash browns are cold. Oh, the, oh, they actually also didn't have iced coffee. It was actually kind of a bad McDonald's experience. Normally I'm, I, I play defense for these restaurants that we go to that my parents don't like. But um, this time it was actually kind of bad because they didn't have iced coffee for some reason. And to be fair, the hash browns were cold and our food was sitting there right in front of us for like five minutes. But it was pretty okay. I had a sausage and an egg and cheese McGriddle and a sausage burrito and a hash brown and coffee. I had to go for hot coffee, which I don't know. Honestly, McDonald's coffee is so mid. Uh, the iced coffee is really good. I really like McCafe iced coffee, but like, yikes. Like, their, their hot coffee is just bad. Um, so, you know. Um, and then uh, we got to work. I'm gonna show you guys what's in that box in a little bit. And then we got to work. Um, I cut some steel. Um, uh, we've been, I've been cutting steel yesterday and today. Yesterday I was very bothered by it. Um, today I'm rather content with it. Um, you know, it's a lot of work and it's really bothersome and I'm not very good at it. But, um, you know, you just gotta get more practice. And I'm really helping the company and help people, you know, because it's probably the one of the harder parts of the job. And so, you know, I, I, I like to be doing it as opposed to someone else, like who's an engineer who could be using their time way more efficiently, you know? Um, and yeah, um, yesterday, Tuesday morning, I entered the raffle for um, some, some Yeezy foam runners in the carbon colorway, size 11. I might need to get size 12. If so, I will resell them and then just buy them in size 12 for like maybe $30 more resale, um, which is a little bothersome, but you know, what can you do? Then maybe I'll have the choice for colorway, right? Um, but I entered the raffle not expecting to win and I totally won. I don't know when they'll arrive. My app says Monday, but we'll see. Um, I also might have COVID. Um, like an hour before I left work, my mom came in and she was like, hey, I just called, called dad. Uh, dad has COVID and my dad has been sick for couple days and we never suspected COVID because COVID's not, I don't know, COVID's not in the zeitgeist, you know, nobody's talking about COVID. And we, so we never suspected it was COVID, but you know, COVID's still real and my dad got COVID. So um, I probably have COVID, my mom probably has COVID. Um, even though my mom didn't test positive, I didn't take a test, uh, but we're probably not gonna go to work tomorrow, but most likely not. We're gonna take a test tomorrow morning. And even then we probably still won't show up because it's spooky. Like my, my dad is, like I was sitting one foot away from my dad, like, not a, not even three minutes ago. Um, also, today is the first preseason Seahawks game. As you know, I live in Seattle, the Seahawks city. Um, so my dad's watching that. We're pretty big Seahawks fans. Um, I think Marshawn Lynch. I, I don't I don't know who left. I uh, really, I think Russell Wilson left actually, which sucks. But you know, I don't know much about football. It's pretty entertaining to watch though. I used to not get the rules because so then it was really boring, but now, you know, it's pretty fun. Uh, right there, yesterday is my air backpack. I didn't show it yesterday because I was just so tired, but yeah, check it out. It's the Air Pro Pack 20 liter. It's really nice. It's about this size. Um, it's got some branding there and some branding here. I didn't know what this tag is, but it's like a single, like, you really have to feel it in real life, but it's like a rubber tag and you would expect it to like loop over, but it's just like a single piece of thing that sticks out. Pretty, pretty minimal branding, which I like. Um, um, here's the very front pocket, which is like a utility pocket with some stuff. Uh, in this pocket is the place for your air tag, which is cool. Like you just you just place your air tag in here, um, but you can zip this up. 
Um, and then you just have like some stuff. You can put like a battery in here, like a pencil. I'll probably put a put a rot ring in here when I get one. Um, and then uh, you open up the next pocket, and it's actually, um, yeah, it's basically just like a. Hold on, is this correct? No, I lied to you guys. Sorry. Um, that's why I was confused for a second. Then, the second pocket actually goes all the way down, and it's this entire thing. And it just, it just opens. Like, it opens completely up, which is really cool. Uh, it's pretty thick. Uh, it can fit one uh, Easy Gap hoodie. Um, so, that, you know, that's some context. Uh, it's got a little pocket right here. Um, it's got a little separator here, so that's nice. Um, I'll probably put my hoodie in here, or, um... I don't know, my, my lunch and my hoodie, probably. Um, you gotta kinda squeeze it, but honestly, I might I might not wear my hoodie into high school, I, I, into college, I might get something else. Um, I, I, I'll probably wear my hoodie, though. Um, and then right before the laptop pocket is this um, sort of weird pocket. I'm not, I'm not entirely sure what this pocket's for, but you know, it's nice. It's just got some like separators. Um, and then, uh, right here is the laptop pocket, and it's actually, it actually has an AquaGuard's, uh, zipper. It's kind of, it's the one with, like, a shine on it, uh, and you open it up, and, uh, it's nice, it's pretty padded, um, this is where you put your laptop. Um, there is a 20 liter and a 24 liter version, I got the 20 liter. And uh, it just barely fits my water bottle. Um, there we go. Check it out. I only drink my water my water out of 40 ounce water bottles, and uh, it's pretty tight in there, so it's pretty secure. Like I have to yank on it to get it out, but um, you know, it's nice. I'm happy about it. And uh, yeah, the pads are, are pretty nice. It's got a pretty interesting sternum strap system. I'm sorry, I wish this was brighter. I don't want to open my window. Um, and yeah, it's a nice backpack. Um, I gotta think about it. I might get the 24 liter. I'm, I'm just, I've just been looking at it. I think it'll be good because it will definitely fit any laptop I want. But, you know, I don't know. Maybe I want a, a bigger backpack. Um, but yeah, I don't know when my, my phone renders are showing up, but we'll see. And, uh, yeah, alright, see you, dude.